the journey so far. In the beginning, death sought the Crow Father, but what he found was something more. A secret once forgotten, a path to another world. Welcome back, First Echo Company. This is your Brigade Commander reporting for duty, and here we're back playing Darksiders 2. Yes, we're back as death. And we're here to take on the cauldron, to summon the fires of the mountain back to the Maker's Forge and stuff. So let's hop right to it. So yes, Last time we came here, we saved Karn, or Pup. We saved his ass. And now the entrance to the cauldron has been bestowed upon us. Step aside, thine fuckers. Because we coming in hot. Now, there are... Yeah, we've got the, the climby stuff, the glowy shit, all this. I see an enemy over here, so I'm tempted to go slay him. Them. Yes, come at me, brah. Level up. Sweet. Now I can put that uh, action point or whatever into uh, something else. Oh, these arm blades aren't as fast. Or aren't as... Oh, fuck. I guess it wants me to put... Increases the health. Cost three... See, this is going to cost me a lot of wrath to activate. So I think the more that I put it into these points, the less it's going to cost eventually. Yeah, there we go. So I'm just going to pick up those arm blades. And there's a chest over here. So we shall grab this chest. Out its hearts. Some coveralls. I think I'll take them. Ah, now my now my leather straps are lightly brown rather than purple. Fantastic. This is no place for a horse. I have to go alone. Ah. This is no place for a horse. Yes, this is no place for a horse. <laughs> oh my god, yes. I understand the concept of it. I gotta pick this up. However, if I see glowing corruption like this, this can be blown up. Or smashed later on. So I'm gonna throw this bomb there. And oh look! A loot chest! The treasures await me. Oh god. What is this? Um. Okay. A savage buckler. So it does more fast damage, has piercing damage, and critical damage. Okay. So what is that? Oh, it's like a big arm piece. And cool, it looks like a Durgan. That cool Durgan. But also, here's a Wrath Potion. I will take that. Ninja run! Oh shit, no, not the... I'm just attacking purely with the... There we go. Not bad, not bad. I prefer heavy weapons like axes, hammers, and glaives, stuff like that. But I am, I am diggity down with the arm blades, you know, test out new weapons. That's what I'm probably gonna do. I'm not gonna go for a specific setup in this gameplay because that's that's what I do on my actual like playtime account and everything. I'm trying to get all the executioner gear and all the. Oh, okay. Ooh, whoa. Well then. Knock, knock. Damn. Not bad. So the other guys... You, uh... You having some problems there, buddy? That's <laughs> it. The face. Oh, my... My wooden cock is broken off. Fuck. Here, let me let me open that for you. Oh shit. Not gonna hold the door this time, bitch. 
Where's there's a lock, there's a key. If there's a lock, there is a key. Oh my god. <laughs> That's amazing. It's almost as if I played this game before. Yes. What's in here? Besides death. And lava. And more death. I'll take that boatman's coin. Thank you. Oh, I see some climby shit. Is parkour needed? Probably. So you notice that this this uh, whole game is based off of dungeon crawling. Oh my gosh. I hit my controller sometimes. Okay, there we go. My controller has indeed killed me many a time with uh, improper you know, joystick placement. Okay, so there's a little corruption ball. There's a huge fight going on over there that I can't be a part of just yet. But, uh, ooh. Hello. So there's a locked door here. There's a barrel. Fuck you, barrel. Some climby shit, so let's climb the shit. Alright, ooh, ooh. Let's get that up there. I like... Oh, God, that's gotta suck. I like how it sounds like... Like he's a horse. That's hilarious. Oh, wrong way. Fuck. There we go. Alright, now I'm just gonna spam the A button. Flip. Flap. Flirp. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, parkour. Haha. This is no place for a horse. But this is a place for a horseman. Uh, excuse me, sir. It's, it's horseman, which means you are a rider. Horse. If you say horse man, then you know, that is implicating that you are half horse. Oh, and who's saying that I don't have a nice long horse face? <clears throat> Anyways. And boobity schmoople. Uh, hey! Nice! Let's see. I, I don't think I need that. Can I just jump it? Yep, I can. And those guys will duke it out over there. Hmm. Another. Oh. Oh, cutscene. Death and lava mixed with stone. Oh. What's this guy? You look lightly corrupted. Construct adjunct. Oh, he's. Oh, he's a grenadier. All right. Alright, there's a lot of you. Come on, you little bitch! Come on, you little bitch! I'll focus on you. You seem to be the tougher one. There we go. He's down. What about the other ones? Come at me! Whoa! Okay, so the arm blades are pretty good, especially with evasive maneuvers, but still. Nope, no rock throwing for you. Nope. I'm just gonna back your ass into a corner and beat the shit out of you. The first rule of Darksiders never talk about Darksiders. Oh, it's, oh, that's interesting. It's playing that music. Which is funny because I know what that music is initially for, but it's playing for... So, here's another thing that you will most likely know. Just like in The Legend of Zelda, there's always a chest that looks exactly like this in every single dungeon that has a map. You don't need to find a compass, but you can find a map. I personally never use the map. I just use the little dial compass thing down at the... The bottom right to show where there's locked doors, open doors, or where there's chests. Hello! Here's some enemas. There we go. Oh, he's, he sounds pissed! Let's get him with the arm blades. Arm blades! Yes! No, evade! Evade! Ow, I evaded, you little bitch. Execute. Yeah. 
Ooh, the stalker's coming this way. Okay, okay, just... Woo! Gotta handle the small fry. No! Just kill the small fry, ah, fuck! Oh, I need to use a, a health thing. Alright, he just handled it for me. I wish I could execute this guy. Woo! Come on, me bro. Come at me, bro. Oh, that was must have been the critical chance. Oh, fuck. God, these guys are tough. Ow. Jesus Christ! All right, there we go. Good coveralls. Ooh, resistance. That will that will definitely be helpful. Very much so, be helpful. Also, you definitely want to try and break every single barrel or whatever that you can, because sometimes, like, I just broke that barrel and there was a, there was a boatman coin in there, so you gotta... Oh my god. There we go. That would be another instance as to where I would like the Meteor Strike ability. Oh look, a key. A key is a key! Man, I'm low on health. Yes, hold hold this. Nope, wrong button. It's time. Yes. It's time you've proved your worth, Dust. You're just flying around like a little birdie bitch. Get to work. Alright, so that indicates that I have to go this way. Hmm, man, that's a huge gap. I wonder... Oh my god! Look at that. Amazing. Now we just have to get back across. Oh look, there's a little dip. Yay. Not a problem. Now you'll see on the little compass thing that there's other rooms that I haven't discovered and it actually shows that there are... Uh, uh, chests that I have not discovered yet. This this arm this arm doodad isn't bad, but yeah, it's showing like there's stairs this direction, so it must it must be in the other room. Yeah, that must be in the other room. There's a chest. Well, there's a lock. There's a key. I like to stick my big purple key into your lock and open the door. Oh yes, this is one of the Forge Land's finer puzzles. Taking the big glowy ball and putting it in the hole. Fantastic. Watch this. I have the best grip ever. I, from this position, I can roll it backwards. Oh my god, I'm the best! Boop. Nice! Oh, wouldn't have suspected that would be there. None whatsoever. Okay, now if I remember correctly, there is in fact a... Yep, there it is. Scooch on over and... Whoop! Boopity schmoople, there we go. Now you notice on the little compass that there is in fact... A chest. Oh shit, there we go. Rip out its heart. Okay, so these, these do more damage. I uh, will take that, then. Because I feel like at this point, I... Uh, boy, I need to go this way. Whoop. I need to constantly upgrade myself. Uh, in my other my other playthrough, I would save onto stuff if it had fantastic perks. And I think I might do that here, but I'm going to be more focusing on... Or more focused on upgrading myself as much as possible. So if I find a pair of scythes that do more damage, I might take them. Unless the ones that I have are not that far behind in damage and have amazing perks. Which is, is, is always a good thing to do with RPG. Like this right here. This buckler is the same, it does the same amount of damage that the current buckler I have does. However, comma. You'll notice that in my heavy weapons, the current buckler that I have has piercing damage and critical damage 
uh, plus eight percent. So I'm gonna stick with these, but I'm saving all these because I can fucking just sell them and get it out of gold. So I will pick these up, but I will not use them. What a lovely place. The atmosphere is, oh god, hello Death Mountain. How are you? Which way do we gotta go? Break all the pots, there might be money. So we'll go to this side first. And, nope, nope, I didn't mean to press that. Oh god. And look this way. Yes. Hey, hey, ladies and jellyfish, we got ourselves a big chest. This sometimes holds awesome gear or a shit ton of gold. Okay, so this one has lower defense, but increased critical damage. Now, in combination with the buckler, which does more critical damage, uh, plus 8%, we will add this so that our critical chance is increased by, what, 11%? So the boost may not give the best defense, but we're getting a slight boon either way. This is the world of RPG. Where anything can be climbed so long as there's vines. Unless it's, you know, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild and then everybody can climb anything. It's not just a boulder, Squidward. <laughs> it's a rock. So I push this lever, and it opens the door. Oh, look, yeah, yeah, there's a, a downward air, wait, wrong way. Ah, there we go, this way. As we go further into the depths of the cauldron. Oh, that, uh, well, I'm sure that took centuries to make, and now it's just, you know, going down a lot of, hey, good sir, do you mind? I am admiring this precious art! Later, bitch. Okay. So, there's a locked door here. And there's an open door here. But the next open door looks fairly large. Hmm. I wonder! Oh, it's a puzzle. I thought it was going to be some epic boss battle, but hey, a puzzle works too. Ah. Trying to save as much wrath as I can, although it would probably be best if I use them because I just get wrath with every strike. Not as much wrath as I want. Man, I'm going to back you into this fucking corner and beat this sh <laughs> Yeah. Nope. There's some boots. Save that for later. Okay, so there's a ball here. Oh, there's a... So this isn't spinning around. This looks like a Book of the Dead page. Yep. Look at that. Our first Book of the Dead page. Nice. So I'm going to Naruto run over this way. So there's a ball right here. Shadow bombs can be used to destroy corruption. If only I could reach it. Man, this ledge is in my way. Ah. Anyways, I'll go ahead and take this. And whoop! Awesome. So now this thing is free, which means I can use it for other purposes. If I could get it out, of there. excuse me, pardon me. There we go. So I could just instantly put it there because that's the first hole I see, and I'm a man, so I just gotta shove things in holes. But we're not gonna do that. We're going to meticulously, and carefully, and precisely stick it in this hole. Yay! Now we have a second ball to play with. More manly stuff. I'm going to take this all the way over here. And stick it in this hole. Oh, almost. We've almost got her. Now it just... God, fuck. I hate this... Th little tiny ledge. Can't just lightly step over it? Nope, gotta jump over it. Alright. Because reasons! Now you notice that this thing is currently lodged, but I have a shadow bomb. You know what explosions do? They dislodge stuff. 
What a concept that is. I'm not dissing this game, I'm just I'm just trying to create banter while I play, so it's not just gameplay of death rolling balls around. I really like these puzzles, and when I first played them, I was like, huh, that's that's interesting to the character type that uh, we are. Because, I mean, you're not going to see Link doing stuff like that. You know, pushing around giant balls and pushing them in holes to unlock gates and stuff, and then get a giant key. Yes, I'm, I'm quite aware that it's a it's a giant key. It's not like I haven't seen one before. But now we're going to push on through to this room, and we're going to take back our freedom. <laughs> or do whatever is necessary, because I know we don't really have any grand scale bosses, I think. Huh. There's a lot of details. Oof, them graphics. Any gold? Hey! Oh, there was another boatman coin in there. I want to say postman coin for my for my good buddy Jacob, the postman. So logic would denote that if I pull if I push this lever, I will probably have to climb over there, jump over there, and then do something with these chains to get across. Fuck it, let's do it. Huh. Well, I was not wrong. There's no time to waste. Yes. Let me yell at myself. It's no time to waste. So we'll just drop down. <gasps> oh man, I'm always worried about missing that. There we go, there we go. And jump! It's good douche. Made it. Ah. A little climby spot for climby death. All right then. Go this way. Oh no, no, not that way. Up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now we're cooking with lava. Hmm. So there's a shadow bomb here, but there is an area of corruption that I could not get to previously. So. Whoop. What does it hold down there? Whoop. Ooh. Big chest. You know how I like big chests. Hmm. Lower damage by a good chunk, but has wrath on execute. Not going to do that because my execution chance is not increased by that much. Ah, crap. Now I got to do this again. Come on, Death. Work with me. No, you're... You're not working with me, Death! Jesus Christ. What? What are you doing?! Bruh. Bruh, what are you doing? Okay. Like I said, so, my controller, I've... I've used my Master Chief controller from... Eh. I don't got time to use. I've been using my Master Chief controller since I got Halo the Master Chief Collection and Halo 5. So it, it's been like a good two, three years now. And uh, yeah, this I, I, it, the controller instantly wants to list lazily to the left. So anytime that I'm trying to go in a rightward direction, my character either slows down or I have mishaps like that, where I'm trying to go to the right, but my character's like, fuck you, we're going to the left. Oh, but it works instantly as soon as I want to go to the left. Fuck you. I need to get a new controller, I need to get a new headset. I mean, there's nothing wrong with these turtle beaches, but I'm just saying, you know. Oh, God, fuck. Let's 
There's nothing wrong with them whatsoever. I just, I would like a new headset that isn't super sensitive. Because anytime I want to play with other people and they've got like very sensitive uh, headsets, they'll pick up my volume, even though I'm, t I'm talking quietly, and it'll come out super loud. Which for streams, I guess, is a good thing. But still. Still but. But still. See, now it's saying that I can fast travel and do all that stuff. It's like, I don't, I don't want to fast travel. Step it. Okay. So what do we got going on? It's quiet. Too quiet, despite all the lava and metal bits. Those boxes are looking suspicious. I will attack those boxes if they dare charge. Oh! Mini boss! Jesus Christ. Okay, hold on. I don't have heavy weapons like I'm used to, so I can't stun him. There we go, there we go. Come on, come on, come on. Oh! Jesus, should have seen that coming. Garden! Why well, you got to do this? Ah! Right in my face. You know, you think I would learn. There we go, I had enough wrath. Alright. Woohoo! Get shit on Garn! Just a little bit more. Yes! Dark Avenger. This weapon once belonged to a human warrior known as Draven. Fantastic. What's this? Hey, defense and arcane. I don't really care for arcane, but I guess we'll pick it up. Hmm, look at all these boxes. I wonder if they have health potions and stuff in them. How about some gold? Yes. Oh, there we go. Well, well it's always good to stay at max health, because... Unless you have heal steel on your scythes, which doesn't show up till much later on. Trust me. <laughs> oh boy. When I got my first set of heal steel fucking scythes, I was so excited. And there's also possessed weapons which you can upgrade. When I get my first possessed weapon, I will show you. I will I will let you know what I'm talking about. Because it is the best. Just gonna break all these jars. Because fuck you. Might be money. Yeah, there's money. Not a lot of money, but there's money. Oh god, but. I was nearly consumed by the wall. It's been taken over by corruption. There we go. Get all the health potions. Yes! We need these. Sweet, googly moogly. All right, let's get this fucking chest and get out. What is this? Oh, there's more, more stuff to sell, to sell, to sell. Ooh. Mm hmm. So I'm gonna turn off my phone. There we go. Fuck you. Oh, hey, Kitty Softpaws. Nice of you to join us. Right as we're about to pull the lever. You know, don't mind that I've been working my ass off. Fighting monsters and getting... Book of the Dead pages. Fuck you. Alright, so let's get this done. Pull the lever, Krunk. And it's the right lever. Come on now. Oh. Nice. 
So now we got the lava flowing, and the cauldron has been completed. All right. Well, I definitely think this would be a great place to stop. But hey, that's awesome. We're we're getting on through, no problem whatsoever. Um, there's a chest in here. I'm gonna get this chest. Wow, it was nothing but gold. All right, fair enough. Oh yeah, and there was also a chest in here. Hold on, let's not end the episode just yet. That's the, the boatman's coin right there. Let's uh, let's get it. Fuck! Oh, I got it. Yay! I'm so happy. We'll get this chest. We'll skedaddle on out. We'll talk to Karn, and then we'll end the- Ooh! Critical chance? Critical damage? I'll take that. What do these look like? Oh, those are nice. Those are pretty swanky sights. They are hip and fly. And I'm a pretty white guy. It's so, so dark in here. You think they might focus on central lighting or something? What's up, Karn? The mountain has a voice. How did you? No, no, doesn't matter. You have done what we, what I, failed to do. You must take the good news to Alia as soon as you can. What is Mordant do? Mordant yes. What is does the Mordant do? If you let them too close, you'll find them in Drangefort. Walk softly, though. Those things are nasty. Huh. Man, you are... You are fantastic. You see... Uh, nope, look, I'm not even doing... I'm not doing anything. And... Uh, I guess... I guess we'll just do this. Anyways. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm Colonel Hammond, and until next time... You're dismissed.